I really enjoy gathering content for y'all, especially when it deals with sports cars like my Z06 or really like a McLaren or a fully blown Corvette. Oh my God, the thing's a beast. And speaking of beast and crazy, Mad Max, the funny car. These are three fun sports cars that I want to share with you. Welcome to Road Odyssey and thank you for joining me. And if you like the videos that I provide, please subscribe and you can follow me every day for what I'm up to on Facebook. I begin with the Sinister C4, a 1986 Corvette, currently for sale for almost 90 grand. So this build began somewhere prior to 2015. And you can find that video and a couple of others from one and four years ago. Just look up Sinister C4 and you can find some really good, healthy information. Now, currently, a guy local to the Paris, Texas area owns this car. This Corvette is set up as a pro street dragster. Lots of carbon fiber. I apologize, I have no information on the build, so it's pretty much whatever you can see and figure out that this build is, uh, that's it. But yeah, tons of carbon fiber, nice, nice paint job. This is uh, a show car, basically. Uh, it probably has rarely gone down a drag strip. It's all for show. But you know what? With this big, fully blown engine, it sounds fantastic. The roll cage is in great condition. The interior is in great condition. Um, it's just really a beautiful, beautiful build. Now, let's next see some action clips. I get it coming in and leaving uh, the Paris, Texas first Friday night car meets. And so here we go. Here is a very nice McLaren 675 LT, probably somewhere around a 2016 or so. These are currently going for somewhere around, I'm guessing, around 200 to 250 grand. 
So, you know, they're pretty high dollar supercars and they're are they're extremely fast. Uh should be over 660 horsepower. Uh believe the RPM will go up past 7000. So, it's kind of in the ballpark of my C8 Z06. But I'm sure it's a lot faster around the track. Obviously, lots of carbon fiber everywhere, probably including a carbon fiber tub, making this quite a light car. Weighing in, I believe, at 2,900 pounds, uh, juxtaposed to my C8 Z06, which is about 3,400 pounds. The back of this is beautiful. Uh, really great venting for the engine. And let's just listen to it as it leaves. Uh, it's fairly new. It's a 675 LT. Thank you. We'll see you guys. Have fun. The last of my three favorite sports cars, well, Mad Max Nitro Funny Car. It was awesome. And meeting everybody was fantastic as well. So let's uh, watch a little bit and enjoy this car in action. After the run, it was into the pits and diagnosing the engine, seeing what did or did not need to be done. In this case, there was a bad valve, so they had to take uh, not just the slip uh, clutch, because those things get deadly hot and worn, so you got to swap them out. But they also had to take the whole top off, the blower unit, you know, the, the air intake stuff, and get all that taken off. Then they had to take the right-hand side heads off, and that is the whole head with the, you know, those zoomy-looking exhaust pipes. So just sit back and watch this for a little bit and enjoy it. Now, I do have a fully blown video about this car. So if you just go back in time a little bit, you'll discover it and you can enjoy this whole thing so anyway here we go with a little bit more on this car hope you enjoy it
as I continue to show you a little bit more of what I had available for the Mad Max, just reminding you, these were just three of my top, top sports-oriented cars so far of 2024. So hopefully for the next half of 2024, I'll have another few cars that were really cool that I could share with you. So with that, please relax, take it easy. I'll see you later. Goodbye, and please like and subscribe. And for sure, view, 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 views are super important. So see you later.